You know, now with the Garden Reserve, it has just increased awareness across the board because so many civilians now have been touched by a cousin or an aunt or an uncle that's involved in the war that wouldn't have been. And so I think there's a deeper appreciation for what military kids, what they go through. I have three children of my own, and of course we've faced all those little challenges that I wish there'd been an MSEC around to, to help. Our youngest son had to transfer from um, a school in Virginia to a school in Texas, and when they, he left Virginia with like a f three, five, four, and they recalculated his grades in Killeen, Texas, and he had like a three, four, two. Wanted to go to University of Washington, which is where we're from, go Huskies, and if you have a three, five, it's an automatic acceptance, so the poor kid had to kind of sweat it because it's very competitive to get into University of Washington. So he shouldn't have had to sweat that. And his dad was in Iraq and, you know, it was just one more little stressor that if I had known how to work the system a little bit better, I would have done that. And every time they explain it to you, you it's like going to the doctor, you think it makes sense, and then you try to explain it again and it doesn't make sense. So. It's, you know, the mother power is what usually solves all those problems, so you work through them, but now there's this wonderful tool to help.